Hello, Nomad's Cult, and with version 2.2, there's yeah, a pivot export thing. I don't know exactly what it is, but it helps to export the pivot positions here, like this here. So we need an example. So here, this object here, uh, there are pivot positions. So here to move the arm and so on. And yeah, and the head, uh, the pivot position is here. And for this one, it's here and so on. And I export now this object here as a GLTF file all and I export it. So I save it in the files. Okay, so now in another app here, so I import now this file. Okay, it's here. So now when I select the objects here, you see here the pivot point is here and not here in this position. So the same for the head sphere, the anchor point, you see it here. So the pivot is here and here. And here in this app, the pivot is uh, in the center. And here uh, for, the, for the arms here, so the, yeah, I think here, sphere, this one, yeah. And um, for the arms, the pivot point is here somewhere and not at this position. Okay, and how to fix it? So first I have to delete this file. And then here in the hierarchy, I select all the, the objects, so multi-selection. And then here I press mesh pivot like this. So now it's grayed out. Export, export, save, save. And now, sorry, I create a new scene. And then I import this mesh. So now, so when you select now the single um, objects, the pivot point is in the correct position where you want it. So now it's possible to use a posable mesh, for example. Okay, that's it. Um, it's a very useful thing for other apps, maybe Blender or something, uh, I don't know, um, other software who needs this. Okay, that's it. Have fun with sculpting and ciao.